What's good, good people? Y'all know I'm a, I'm a few days late. It's a few days late. Y'all know certain losses, I have to process different. Like certain losses, I could just immediately just grab the camera, grab the phone, get on in and rant. But certain losses, I have to process different. These was this was one of those losses I had to process different. That's why the video is late. Game happened on Sunday. It is Tuesday. I'm just recording this video, but. I just had to figure out where we went wrong. Why we always go wrong on these type of games. I say these type of games. Big game, on the road, playoff environment, intensity there, like the spotlight is on us. And we go into the shell of ourselves where I was telling someone before the game. I said, we probably barely scratched 24 points, which we had 23. But the week before, we had 40-something points. We were the superior team last week. This team, maybe the superior team, the Eagles, or we on the same playing field, however it goes. But those big games, I said last week we had like, it's probably five, six penalties. Last week we played great on all cylinders. We had a special team um, play. We had a defensive touchdown. Offense played great. Defense played great. And I knew this week it wasn't going to be the same. We didn't have a lick of play from the special teams. We didn't have a lick of play from the defense. We had we registered a few sacks. That's about it. But it just wasn't the same. We had ten penalties, and I asked myself why every time we get into these games, we 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 go tuck our tails and hide. <clears throat> we don't produce like that same energy that we had against the team when we are the superior team. I don't know why. And like it's 10 penalties. Again, it's awful. And I'm going to make like a few parts of this game. I'm, so next, um, later today, you're going to have a picture of, of, of Steele, who was this awful. I mean, Steele probably gave up three or four sacks, which I don't understand why we didn't leave like the running back in. I, I'm over the five wide. I am over the five wide, especially when we're getting dominated by one of our tackles, which will be Steele. Leave a running back in, chip. Help out with the pass blocking if we are struggling. He gave up like a sack, sack and a half or two sacks to Graham. Old guy. He like 48. But anyway, he came out, Philly hit us in the mouth. We um countered. We hit them back, 7-7. Like Philly scored again. Then we scored 14-14. Before the half, Michael Gallup. And this is those key moments where I be telling y'all we shrinking. It was like third and two, something like that. Michael Gallup crossed the middle for a three-yard pass, and he dropped it. Simply dropped it. Could have kept the drive going. We could have, like, gotten more points. And I'm talking about more points for us, like a touchdown, because we ended up having to kick a field goal, which made it 17-14 at the half. But those key things right there, we got to capitalize on. Can't come across the middle and just completely drop the ball, Michael Gallup, which got his ass bench. Thank you, Mike McCartney, for benching him. Tolbert came in, who proceeded to... Um, he caught a touchdown second half um, of the game. Going to the second half, they came out first drive, second half, hit us in the mouth. You give it to me. 21-17. They did what they needed to do. Uh, then they went up 28-17. Then we scored. Going for two. And a lot of things just, just didn't go our way because even when we got down there, it was a lot of bad calls. A lot of bad calls and a lot of missed calls by the officiating crew. But I'm not big on... We got cheated. I'm not big on that talk right there. Because even with all those things, we still had a chance to win the game. But it was it's, it's called a game of inches. Even on that play where the tight end, um, the little out route, he was short. Good call. But the defender did get there early. But he was short. It's just those things where we have to be better at when I say, hey, run the route better. Ferguson has got to chip that man. Not even chip, but he got to. He has to show more so Shoemaker could come out and create more space on the out route. Great pass by Dak. He did what he needed to do. It just came up short. Regardless, we stopped him. We get the ball back. We go down to score. We try to go for two. Game of inches again. Dak Prescott reach out. We initially, it was called a successful two-point conversion, but we go back and look at the review. He was out. Y'all, he was out. Game of inches. But that's on us, too, because we have to put ourselves, know where we are on the field, shoemaker, and know where we on the field. Dak 
Dakota Prescott to know, hey, we can't do those things. The championship teams wins, win those type of games right there. We still not there mentally. We're not there. We're not focused enough to know situational football. But even after that, boom, we stop Philly again. They get a third down. They hand it off to Swift. He running, running to A.J. Brown, fumble. Michael Parson, your all-pro player, go get the ball. Couldn't get it. Which takes small seconds off. You know, we call it timeout, but we could have saved the timeout possibly because it's been changing down. And we'd have had the ball to 30. We had to start all the way from our 17 yard line. Even though we got a good pass in the first call, which was actually passing for us on, on Bradbury, we couldn't do nothing with it. We were first and 10 at the 11 yard line. First and 10 at the 11 yard line. I want them to say the first 10 at the 11 yard line and couldn't do nothing with it. Let me tell you where we ended up. We ended up like a third and 26, third and 27. Unacceptable. With 20 some seconds. Unacceptable. It's just those things I'd be like, would, would Philly self explode like that? Would, would, would Philly or 49ers or the Chiefs, would, they would have took a first and 10 from the 11 yard line and went all the way back to like the 27 to 30 yard line? No. Because what we do, fall stop, the leg game, sack. We did everything, self inflicting wounds as we, we killed us because we're still not that team. And y'all wonder why Stephen A. Smith always saying accident waiting to happen. Because that's what we are, accident way now. Because we just don't know how to win those kind of games. And it's going to come, it's going to cost us in the playoff. In those big moments, those big games where we need to perform, it always costs us. But hey, good game, though. Shout out to um, Dak. He played awesome. He had 374 yards, three touchdowns. He, he, he was dipping and dabbing all over the place. We had like five drop passes, though, which don't make me feel good. And also, I'm still concerned about this running game. Till we establish some type of running game, we're going to be this team right here where everything's depending on that. But I digress. Um, I see y'all again. We have Giants next week, a division game. We need to win, need to win, need to win. Okay? All right, good day.